occasion releasing the Buddha's Sutra called Vajra Chetika Sutra, the Dharma Sutra. So, in my life, I have visited the so many different places, and I always used to say the one thing that Buddhism is about religion, it's a science of mind. So I always feel that the Buddhism is a science of mind. So Buddhism, the main purpose of the Buddhism is to bring the more inner happiness in the man and the human, to bring the more peace in the human mind. So as you can see, today we are releasing the book Vajrachetika. This book is one type of book which helps you to bring more inner happiness and, and the inner peace. In my life, so many people used to ask me the one question, what is the meaning of the life? My answer for that question is a very simple. Meaning of the life, meaning of the living, is live happily. That's the most important thing. So one thing that I would like to remind you that the, the Buddha, as I told, as I mentioned before, the Buddhism is a one of that points, it is a one technique which teaches us how to live happily and peacefully. One occasion, I was in the world now. Several people used to tell me that the Buddha said, you may live long, you may live long. I told them, if I were you, I won't say that you may live long. I would say that you may live happily, but you are living very long without happiness, without peace. So as we are the human, we are the God. We, are, we have to live. Now there is a two way of living. Live with happily and peacefully, live unhappily. I think we all choose to live happily. Now to live with happily and peacefully, we have to know how we have to live peacefully, how we have to live happily. That's why, as you can see very clearly, when the Buddha founded the Buddhism, when he preached the Buddhism, because of overcome his stress, his depression. If you look at the Buddha's life history, it's very clear. Once the Buddha was in, when he was in his palace, his mental state was totally <coughs> stressful. His mental state is also stressful and unhappy. To overcome that, he has found the Buddhism. So, don't take Buddhism as a religion. I always used to say that Buddhism is not a religion. It's a science of mind. It helps us how to eliminate our afflicted emotions, destructive emotions. It helps us to reduce our negative emotions. It helps us to promote, increase the positive emotions. So that's why today we are distributing the book, the Dhamma Sutra in Nepali. So that I hope that you will read this book and bring more happiness and more peace in your life. Thank you very much.